Hey, Best Squad, it's your girl, Ebony the Best. So, guys, I am here with another video. Um, really gonna take a little break because this, all this is so much right now. But Dawn Michelle has entered the building, okay? Carson Blue has entered the building. And everybody is going in on this man's childish behavior. So as you know, the neighborhood posted the um, clip of Melody and Martel um, over there. You know, I didn't think it was cute because of the heading um, that this person put, like sensitive content. You know, like she's saying, whoever, if it's he, she, I don't know, was saying, oh, how is it that Melody is going to file um, DV abuse on the husband when she's over here. I just did not like it. But let me let you see what Auntie Dawn had to say. So she said, Tuh. as Mel's manager, I am going to say this. Don't think for one minute that we don't have receipts. Galore, and that was in capital too, which could have ruined her ex-husband long time ago, but that's never what she has been on this incident was the aftermath of t of him taking every penny uh any every penny she has worked hard for hard earn hard earn money this isn't even half of the story though shaking my head stay tuned so it seems as if something is gonna happen because melody you know i think but you know what now that I think about it, Melody's just going to wait till this court date because, you know, he blasted it that it's on the 31st. Um, but let me... And as y'all know, the pick me's was out. So Auntie Don was like, baby, she's not a manipulator. She followed the the head of her, hu her household, who was the ultimate manipulator. And then God removed the blindness. Maybe Mel has a team of god fearing people and one thing that no one can do is for the holy spirit don't be deceived i've been a witness for five years to it all may i ask what rock you've been hiding under because she is doing better now that she has left him carson blue says i can't take martel hold loser eight serious he don't have any motion and neither does his whore nobody gives a blank to hear blank or watch that he's talking about he's talking about unless he's bashing his ex-wife the ex stripper who has more than you and your whore together couldn't have said nothing if you're doing I think Carson is trying to say that she could wouldn't have said nothing if his ding bat a blank whore didn't call a stranger asking her her opinion just like she did with the original straight no tracer nay I'm busy beat it Lord have mercy so as y'all know Martel is being dragged all over these streets. I saw it even into the uh, own love and marriage uh, owns um, conversation group. Uh, he just made an absolute fool of himself, but he doesn't see it that way. He thinks he's hurting Mel. Then also, it's rumored that he docks Melody. So I saw this and my heart leaped. It says, thank you all for the outpouring of concern and letting me know my client has been doxxed by her ex-husband by exposing her address. Trust me, the attorneys, and yes, that's with an S, are on it. Please send me any other evidence of this horrendous act. Now, how dare you, how dare he expose and compromise the safety of you know melody and the eminem kids uh, listen i was in the neighborhood chat i thought that's where the information was released from i don't know i mean i know i'm in tasha k uh her backstage thingy 
I don't see, I haven't heard anything yet about him, you know, giving any address, you know, basically what you guys saw on YouTube is basically everything. The only thing you guys don't see is the videotape that he put out and, um, what else? Yeah. The alleged videotape that that's all that's back. There's nothing much. And, um, what else? I think that was it. So I don't know where it came from, to be honest, that he doxed her. So, y'all, I'm not sure if you guys remember when they posted all those videos of her um, knowing so much that it finally was revealed that it was because of coleslaw. So, I was uh, on these YouTube streets and I saw um, a video. It was a year ago that... It was being reported about the abuse, the AB that Marta was doing to Melody. Um, I found out that um, the original Straight No Chaser was talking to this person. She was telling them how the cops was called and a, a, a lot of stuff. And I'm like, okay, so now he's trying to flip it. Martel is trying to flip it to say Melody was abusing him when this person that was giving Nay the tea says Martel literally had his hands on Melody and then the reason why Melody had went live was so that Martel could leave her leave her alone because he was blocking her he was taking everything so the fact that he presumptuously came online and tried to do this the guy is sick okay the guy is sick. And let me see if I could play that clip. So why, why Mel doesn't have the kids right now? Martel's upset because Mel has her own place that Martel is moving into. Um, and um, when I went to get my clothes today from the marital home, Mark, me in our driveway for hours. Okay? Martel decided that he was going to take certain purses and certain furs of mine and lock up in his truck and say that I can't take them. So while with something that should have been easy and should have been just on some like, hey, I'm not bothering you, I just want my stuff, I'm out. It turned into something more because he wanted it to be something more because he's bitter as hell. So ladies, let me tell you this. I'm sure many of y'all have it's at some point or time dealt with emotional abuse, mental abuse and all of that. After that whole scene, I literally couldn't, and I recorded it. I literally couldn't get out of my driveway. I had a migraine out of this world and definitely set me back from what I was trying to do today, which was get my new home in order for me and my ch I'm not going to put the clip that's behind Tasha Wall because, again, I don't want to be strike, but he made absolutely no sense. All that clip, if you look at it clearly, it's different, different clips that he put together to make it look as if Melody was a being him. And like Jay said, anybody believe that mess? The guy's on hinge. And I just pray that we pray for Melody because y'all, this is too much. Anyway, like, comment, subscribe. Talk to you later. Bye. Just had to tell Lauren, I know you lying. Let me tell y'all something. I've been working, so I just went to my Shopify. When I say today is more orders in one day than I've ever had, Lauren, uh, yes. we're about to be working. No, you. I know you lying. I'm literally, y'all, I'm riding <laughs> over here, and someone just told me, go over there and check Shopify mm -hmm. out. I looked at the number of orders. Girl, they was ordering up while I was doing green screen. Mm -hmm. Your phone was going off. It was going off. I'm telling. <laughs> Girl. Oh, well, we got y'all. We got y'all, though. We going to pack y'all stuff up, ain't we, Lauren? Absolutely. Hmm.